Welcome to the Ambient iPad. I'm back again with the Roland Wind Synth and the Boss Space Echo for some sound on sound looping. I'll be using some different sounds than I typically do, some synthesized string sounds. And I'll also use a pad that has uh, some sample and hold, and we'll do some soloing over that. The signal chain is the Roland AE20 Aerophone. Its stereo output goes into the stereo input of the Boss Space Echo. The stereo output from the Space Echo goes into a Universal Audio Volt 276 interface, which then goes into the iPad Pro. I'm using GarageBand, but instead of just using it kind of like a dollless tape deck, I will use some effects, so a little bit of GarageBand compression, reverb, and I'll also use Spatializer just to widen the stereo field. So the first thing I like to do, I'll demonstrate some of the sounds I'm going to use, and then I'll do a little loop just so you can hear what that sounds like. First, you have to get the space echo into long delay mode. That gives you up to six seconds of delay, which can be tapped. That's the only way you can get to the six seconds. I have a description down below how to do that and a link to a video where I show that. I believe it's page 15 of the online manual. Once you have it in that long delay mode, I suggest putting it on head one tapping out a two second delay, which is a lot easier than tapping out a six second one. Once you have that two second delay down, then just move the head to head three and you'll get the six seconds. At that point, I recommend saving it to one of the memory slots so you never have to worry about it again. That's what I've done. I have it on the last memory slot, number four. And this way I know I can always get to that six seconds, whether I want to use it just in a jam or the six seconds for the sound on sound looping. All right. Let's uh, let me just uh, demonstrate some of the sounds I'm going to use on the uh, Aerophone. Uh, mainly classic Roland string sounds here, some Juno strings. And some Jupiter 8 strings. I use a few others. Uh, here's the pad I was talking about. This has some sample and hold in it. So let me turn the uh, space echo on and I will just create a short loop, just a few notes here and there, a couple of sounds, uh, do a little soloing over that, and then maybe see how the. Um, that pad sound uh, can be worked in pretty quick. Just kind of a walk through to make sure this will work for the jam. So right now we're going here. Let me start with the Juno strings. Jupiter strings. Now the space echo, this isn't really made for the sound on sound looping. In each pass you can hear the sound degrade and get lower in volume, classic sound on sound looping. The fidelity really goes down pretty quickly but it just has a nice quality to it. And uh, the intensity is really what controls the repeats. Uh, I can lower this and then it'll fade faster. Each pass. You get to the pad while that's going down and I'll just add the pad in. All right, so let me, let me move it back up. Now I'm going to add the octave below. Of course, I played the wrong note. Here's the octave below that note. <laughs> So I've got three layers now of that pad. I'm doing it on the beat, so 
Then we would turn that off. Let's go to a synth sound. Let's see here. Let's go to that. Uh, there we go. Probably not the best I could have chosen. Let me try something else. Given that this is kind of a uh, just the setup for the jam, I'm really not too concerned about the sounds or it's more about making sure the process is down. Let's see here. How about a square saw lead? get the idea. I mean, as I was looking for a sound, you know, the volume keeps going down. It's kind of smearing at this point. You can still hear that sample and hold. Now in the jam, there'll be a little more space between. This is kind of everything just kind of layering up and looping up, so to speak. Just getting a little more dense. All right. Well, you know, this is pretty much the setup here. And uh, let me just reset everything, and I will do the jam.
Thanks for watching, thanks for listening, and good luck with your own music.